Oh, hello. Good morning. So, for today, I thought it's gonna be a perfect day. Oh, that's much better. It's gonna be a perfect day to do a vlog and so now I am going to go to a Trader Joe's because since I did my spring cleaning, I just really wanna buy some nice spring flowers. Ooh, my camera, oh my goodness. And um, so I'm gonna go to Trader Joe's now to grab some of those nice spring plants. And then later we are planning to go to a farmer's market. We're going to check it out if they have anything. I'm really looking forward to go there again because they don't have much stuff and they're not even open during the winter months but um, I really like to shop there because there's no packaging so that means less plastic that we have to use so that's great and by the way you guys I don't know what happened but this morning I woke up at 4 so I because I felt like I was well rested, I didn't go back to sleep and I woke up and guess what? I got really productive on those quiet hours when everybody was asleep so it was really great to get up and do a few things. I did some video planning and um, and I answered all of to the comments that was left. Thank you so much guys. I really love connecting with you all. and. Um, Oh, they are open. Okay, so I'm gonna go in, grab those flowers and be back. So this is gonna be mine. Boys, you can sit down and eat. And then Joel is going to drink this until noon. We're going to have some longan as well. So this is what we're going to eat. Okay guys, I'm just going to put it out here so you guys can have some. Did you brush your teeth? Max, did you brush your teeth? Did you brush your teeth? We are heading to the market. So make sure I taking some bags and cash. barely anything on this farmer's market we saw eggs we already have yeah. eggs but it's not much of course it's March so you know and I think people are mainly coming here to eat something so there yeah. is a bunch of food carts there and just uh, boots boot, boot, boots yeah. boots with food so but we are interested in veggies and this kind of stuff so I think we still have to wait a little it's, yeah, it's a little too early for it's them. a little bit too early so we are back and I had an idea 
what to do with the boys because as they're getting older i find that, that they don't want to do as much craft obviously <laughs> they are getting older but i think that project would be something that they would enjoy <laughs> okay so for next month um so we're going to have three birthday lining up this upcoming month and um i'm already planning for the birthdays and so as i was doing my research i have another side that i love so much and if you haven't seen the video that i made about minimalist toys i will link it down below for you guys but this is gonna be similar that we are going to do now but it's an advanced website so there are more um complicated to put it together not as easy i mean i would say it's still uh there are things that are easy to make but there are more advanced as well so even adults can find something there that they love so as i was doing the research i run into something that i just started to love and i'm going to show you why so when my older one was a baby we got this stuffed animal for him and guess what i find the exact same thing that we can recreate from paper <laughs> so this is what i'm talking about and i can just download it and print it so this is how it looks like and this is all from paper so it's kind of like a fun project architecture buildings we did many of this when they were little we printed out this little tiny houses and we used them as toys when they were playing with the cars oh let's make that one too oh i really like that okay let's do that oh that's a ferret it's a ferret <laughs> there's another scissor there you go We are done it's definitely not perfect oh yeah we still have to put on the ears there's the right where's ear the, oh where's the tail and cole is adding details by coloring it a little bit there are a bunch of things that still needs to put on but he decided that he just wanted to color that now spaghetti as you saw i put extra water in there to rinse out this jar so we can use every single of tomato from there but also i like to add more water so when the pasta is halfway cooked i'm going to turn into this big pot and i'm going to cook um, until it's soft in that so it's gonna be more yummy that way So we got a gorgeous weather out there, so we need to go outside. <laughs> 